Hey, this is Darren with another uh, demonstration video. I'm showing the uh, removal of the coffee filter. Uh, a good trick is to just leave this hang above your kettle uh, while it's bringing it up to a boil. Uh, just make sure when you get around 200 degrees you get it out. We're at 199 right now so I'm going to be removing this. Uh, once in a while you can push down on this to get a little extra squeeze on the grain. Uh, once you're done, we're at 200 degrees. I want to make sure I get this out before I start potentially getting a hot break. Uh, so we're going to lift the filter completely so it clears the kettle and with the new brew stand you can just simply rotate the filter and lower it onto a tray. I've got a stainless steel tray down here but what works really well as well is uh, a washing machine tub tray um, or a driveway ceiling tray. Uh, there's a lot of different plastic tubs you can get. Once the uh, filter is down, bring it all the way out, disconnect it and reset your boom. You can see how much of the liquid actually gets extracted from the grains using the coffee filter. This has been sitting here about five or ten minutes and uh, you can see there's very little extra that's dripped out of there. It really dries the grains off. Uh, so you're getting all that sugar out of the grains.